I am sorry about the bumpiness. I am actually, Ruth has got me, she's here. Um, she's actually got me using the tripod, um, but I'm still as unsteady as crap, so we're bobbling about all over the place. We're out on adventures today, so we are going to Lakemere Village, village Market, essentially. We've got a stall there, so we're going to go and uh, get set up. It's about 6.30, 7.30ish this morning. We are on our way to stop off at Mackey's for breakfast because, let's face it, both of us need it. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Um, and definitely, I definitely need it and the caffeine because it's it's unfortunately, you know, our, our lady time. Yeah. It's reasonable. She asked me how I was yesterday and I said, oh, I'm doing really good. And then the cramps hit. Yeah. Sorry. Be a nice friend. Yeah, just passing on the love, isn't she? Anyway, um, I'll leave you with that for the minute and we'll catch up once we get there. We're back again. Hello. She's actually stopped driving, so she's going to say hello now, probably. <laughs> so we're at Blakemere now. Yep. Yep. Uh, Ruth's done this one before. I am here. Um, <laughs> I'm back. She likes to point it at my Hi. face. So, we've just devoured our McDonald's, uh, so we're a little bit happier. <laughs> Agreed. <laughs> um, and Ruth's done this one before. She had to do the last one without me because I, I contracted the evilness. Um, so she ended up doing this on her own the first time. Mm -hmm. I'm going to point, point it at you because we've all got, like, got half of each of our faces in. It's not working. Look at her trying to... Wait, what are you doing? <laughs> Where are you going? Where are you just leaving me? Um, we're going to go and explore and... There's a particular spot Ruth liked from last time, so she's leading on this one. So we're going to be able to make that spot for a bit. And that's how we're going to We are going to watch her do this. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I love it. That's uh, fine. I'll cut that anyway because I laugh like a witch. I am. I am a witch. I believe it. Nicking, but I want you to all note this as well. My clothing keeps going missing and I lend it to somebody on the odd occasion and this somebody keeps... This is a very nice jumper that I had. It's very nice. If anybody spots it... Oh, I think it's over there. Can you let me know? Right, we'll be back in a bit. So we're here and as I said Ruth is leading on this one because she's been here before now you might go you might question her choices I question her choices I always question her anyway she has that she's got the fashion sense and I just wear what the fuck I want of your jumpers get them in there yeah. anyway oh chin people <laughs> okay so let's just get back to the basics so we have options for the the setting up apparently over the other side of the building which is a bit more woodlandy which is nice but it's very busy and we don't like crowds well we do we like crowds around the store for people buying stuff but we don't like crowds around us incense so we've gone the opposite side where Ruth was last time and we have the options of Kind of like the wall setting, and again, just hear her out. This. Now Ruth wants to set up here, 
Now, it's all about location, location, location. Yes. So let's explain the height of this location. A. Toilets. B. Cafe. Caffeine. Need caffeine. C. We have a gazebo and we have had problems in the past with wind where it's moved the gazebo. Tie it. Bailing down. So that could work. And then, and then people come through this way. Uh, yeah, yeah, she's got the access point. So and you've then, got an access point from there. And then the access point. And then an there. access point from, I'm getting used to the whole having to yeah. turn with. Oh, sorry. Access point from here as well. So you've got people coming in and out. So it does make sense. It does make sense. It may not be the most visually pretty thing. And we have two sides of the gazebo we're stuck. But to be honest, if you've ever seen I was going to say if you've ever seen me without makeup, it's not the most visually pretty thing either. <laughs> but yeah, you have seen me without makeup, so everybody's seen me without makeup. I really should make an effort more often. I've seen more. I'm wearing a dress today. I've got my legs out. You have. Ruth's not bothered. She's just nicked my jumper. It's a very nice jumper and it's cosy and it's a bit chilly. Mm -hmm. And I wanted a blacky grey jumper today, and I don't own one, so. Well, I do no, own people. one. It's on my no. wardrobe. She doesn't own one. <laughs> However, she has acquired one. Yes. Oh, there's my dad. Oh. Okay, so Reese's dad's turning up with the gazebo because we couldn't fit it in the car. So we're going to go and give him a hand now. All right, so say goodbye, Reese. Bye. She's so rude. Okay, we're on to set up. I'm going to look a bit greasy because I've put um, sun cream on. It got sunny. Say hello to Reese. She stripped off and took my jumper off to reveal a t-shirt that I did for her as well. Though that isn't my t-shirt for once. She's not nicked that. That's actually hers, but I did paint it. And Very she's cool wearing a necklace everything. I made as well. And am I only the earring? My God. You're done. Ooh, she knew. Did you see that? <laughs> Camera bombed. <laughs> Okay guys, so we've already established that I am crap at vlogging. She agrees. Nod. Yeah. So, I have done a little bit of video footage of the stall and having a bit of a nosy round, but because obviously one of us has to be on the stall all of the time, um, it doesn't mean that me and Ruth can have a bit of a potter around. So there is a little bit of video of footage. Turn left. Well, I hope you know in a quarter of a mile we're turning left. <laughs> Rude! <laughs> I'm trying to video here, record even. Um, so we're just basically on our way back now. Hi, Ruth. And I'm covered in sun cream. Yes. We've actually put some on today. Oh. She's been good. And she did the sun cream. Don't normally, yeah. unless I'm increasing. We did spend a little bit of money getting a few little bits and bobs that we wanted. Um, it was not a great well it wasn't a great time it was quite quiet today it's been nice Ooh, i nearly lost you it's a bit bumpy bear with us um it was been a nice day yeah. the weather's been pretty good but there wasn't too much footfall so store wise it wasn't our best it wasn't our worst no it wasn't our best so we're going to give it best out of three and attempt to book in with them again because the location's really nice and we were saying we wouldn't mind going to blakemere just to have a walk around ourselves i look a bit red I have been avoiding the sun mm. and kept hydrated and I'm still lobster coloured and you're still not. No, and I've sat in the sun all day. There's no justice. At least I'm not sun people aren't so not killing my skin. There's no justice in this world. Anyway, um, so we're going to say goodbye and we're going to go and get ice cream now and chill out and maybe have a little gin and tonic in the garden. Yeah. So we'll see you in the next one. And hopefully not as bouncy. I'm sorry, I'm really crap at doing.